your KRCG 13 Storm Vision Forecast with Zach Evans. Many of us are starting our Thursday with partly to mostly cloudy skies, even some sunshine up north, but rain is on the way. Showers already falling across southern portions of mid-Missouri over Phelps and Pulaski County. If you're in Rolla, grab those umbrellas and this rain is going to slowly make its way up north through the day. South of Jefferson City is going to see the highest rainfall totals, especially if you live near I-44. If you're north of I-70, not going to be picking up quite as much, but you definitely did yesterday. Over the last two days, over two inches of rain at the lake. Columbia got two alone on Wednesday. Rolla just shy of one inch, and if you do live near I-44, could see between about two and four inches of additional rainfall by the time this is all out of here Friday night. Temperatures are in the 60s and the 70s now, just the 70s for mid mo 70 in Columbia, same for the lake. Clinton is at 72, while Rolla is one degree cooler than that. Here's what's going on across the region. Low pressure is spinning to our north. With it is a stalled cold front. That may actually set off a few storms in northern Missouri today. Our area of focus, though, is what's left of Tropical Storm Bill, now a tropical depression. Area of low pressure spinning there near Oklahoma will bring us waves of rain over the next 48 hours. As we see the hour-by-hour -hour forecast, again, highest amounts are going to be south of Jefferson City. As we head into this evening and tonight, we may start to see a break in the rain with just mostly cloudy skies. Those showers will still most definitely be possible overnight. Then as the low lifts to the east and northeast tomorrow, we'll see one more push with those storms. We're finally going to be dry by the time we hit Friday night with some clearing in store for Saturday. For today, all we get is 78 for our high thanks to those clouds and waves of rain. Tonight, maybe a few showers, rumbles of thunder, 67's the low. Here's the seven day forecast. Temperatures in the 80s tomorrow, and then we're jumping into the 90s on Saturday. Could see some spotty storms Sunday and Monday thanks to a stalled cold front. Otherwise, we are hot and humid next week in the lower to mid 90s.